Hadozis are people with simian features that long ago adapted to live among the tall trees of their homeworld. They are natural climbers with feet that are just as dexterous as their hands, even to the point of having opposable thumbs. And they have membranes of skin that hang loosely from their arms and legs. When stretched taut, these membranes allow the Hadozi to glide. Hello there, I'm Jake from J&J &J Tabletop, and in this video we're going to be talking about the Hadozi, which was just introduced in the latest Unearthed Arcana, Travelers of the Multiverse. Hadozis are medium-sized humanoids with a walking speed and climbing speed of 30 feet. And like the GIF, they've only got two features to review, so let's take a quick look. First up, they have access to the Dexterous Feet feature. You can take the Use an Object action as a bonus action. They also have access to Glide, which reads, If you are not incapacitated or wearing heavy armor, you can extend your skin membranes and glide. When you do so, you can perform the following aerial maneuvers. When you fall, you can move up to five feet horizontally for every one foot you descend. And when you would take damage from a fall, you can use your reaction to reduce the fall's damage to zero. Okay, so if we're just taking a look at these features here, um, again, it's just similar to the gift. There's only two of them, and I think when you compare it to the Astral Elf or the Auto Gnome, I feel like you're just really not on the same level in terms of power. However, I think glide is kind of cool. I think flying is one of the most fun things, at least one of the most fun fantasies I like to play out when I play Dungeons and Dragons. And I think this could help scratch that itch a little bit for you. And I also kind of suspect that the dexterous feet feature, being able to use an object as a bonus action, is probably more useful than I'm thinking of. I mean, the only thing I can think of that might be something that probably will kind of tip over a few people's sacred cows because using a potion as a bonus action is technically not the way the rules are written which if that is a house rule that you use that kind of is a useless feature almost in a way unless i'm missing something if you can think of a better way or a different way that using an object as a bonus action might be beneficial let me know in the comment section but just like the GIF, the Astral Elf, and the Auto Gnome, Spelljammer is coming back. The Hadozi, I mean, hey, it even says, they've adapted to live in the tall trees of their home world. That's science fantasy kind of language, and it's very clear that that's what Wizards of the Coast is doing here. So what do you think of the Hadozi? Have you ever played in a Spelljammer game in the past? Maybe you could tell me a little bit about a character that you played or in a game you played in which the Hadozi's ability to kind of just glide through the air might have saved the day or maybe created a really cool moment that just sticks in your memory. I'd love to hear about that. And if you like this video, give us that thumbs up. And if you enjoy Dungeons and Dragons and tabletop role playing games and puns and cheesy humor, I think you would like our channel. So I would highly recommend that you hit the subscribe button and the bell that you never miss an episode. Again, I'm Jake from J&J &J Tabletop. Take care, my friends.